is the CompTIA A plus certification worth it? It definitely is worth it. So what's today's date? Friday, August 20th, 2021. It's still worth it. I just got mine back in February of 2021 and every day I'm thankful that I got it. Every day that I'm studying this stuff, which is the Cisco CCNA exam material, I'm, I'm so thankful because a lot of material that I'm reading out of this book builds on the CompTIA A plus certification concepts. Now, how can I put this? The A plus is a great starting point and it gives you a great foundation to build on top of. It's, it's a vendor agnostic certification. It teaches you all of the hard, basic hardware stuff, all of the basic software stuff that pretty much every other vendor builds on top of because that's just that's just what it is it's just the industry standard right a lot of people are getting the, the a plus certification and thinking to themselves oh was this even worth it because they're not landing a job right away getting my a plus certification made it easier for me to read through the concepts one time or two times and get it without having to backtrack and do research for example say you want to be a network engineer and you decide to skip the A plus like I was about to do and go right into network plus, which I'm glad I didn't. If you're starting to learn about uh, cabling, right? <laughs> if you're learning about cabling, you're gonna be confused because I don't know if the network plus covers cabling, but the A plus covers different types of pinouts, different types of cabling, different types of connectors and things of that nature that you have to know when you're doing this network engineering stuff. And you're robbing yourself because say you're studying for the CCNA, you're gonna be reading, CCNA textbook and there's going to be some terms that come up and you're going to be confused and be like okay what's this and you're going to have to go back and do the research when you could have just gotten all of that out the way by taking the A plus certification exam or just study the A plus material a lot of people say oh yeah you don't even have to get the certification just study the material and then move on right I think people especially in the IT industry are missing a lot of the psychological cues that go along with getting credentialed, getting certified. And I understand it because I have a psychology degree, right? See, it's hanging up on the wall somewhere there. <laughs> but when you get the A plus or even the ITF like I did, it builds your confidence up. Having confidence is very important. You can have all the knowledge in the world, but if you don't have confidence, you're gonna lose. It's definitely worth it to get the A plus because not only does it give you the basic foundation, the fundamentals, the concepts for you to build upon when you choose to specialize or branch out in other areas, but it also gives you that psychological boost. It gives you that confidence. So if you're on the fence about getting the A+, just take this as a sign to go get the A+. A lot of people are pussyfooting around when it comes to making a decision as to which certification they should get. I think anybody who's starting out, just starting out, needs to get their A plus certification. It is a valuable investment of time. Now we have the naysayers that's gonna be in the comment section talking about, oh no, you don't need to do that. It's a waste of time, it's a money grab, blah, 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 blah. blah. Just go out there and get the A plus certification. You're, you're gonna thank me for it later, right? So if you like to listen to other rants, click right here and I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace.